Breathe Deep Beats Production. Driving, man, don't do it at home. But uh, I'm on my way to meet a special guest. Breezy. I will introduce you to the special guest in a second. But uh, we're on the way to the gym. I'll be there in a little bit, so I'll see you on this clip. Tell me what your name is, man. Dion. What's the name of on Instagram? Get my log. I plug myself in there. Yeah. Peace day. I'll put it on the screen <laughs> right about now. I'll put his IG information. I'll put his uh, YouTube. He's got a YouTube channel up down on the screen, too. He's getting ready for his first Classic Physique show in March. Evansville, Indiana Classic. Come check my boy out. He's going to be ready. You know what I'm saying? You can see, he's got great physique on him. We're going to get him up there and get him right. So, uh, we're going to be having more workouts with him. He's going to be featuring some, being featured in some more workouts. So, we'll see y'all in a minute. What's good, everybody? It's your boy Larry of his NFCS Fitness. We are back in the building. Special guest Dion is with me. I'm getting this young man ready for his first Classic Physique show in March, so be on the lookout for that. Um, we're, what we're doing right here, we're doing um, a combination of different raises, laterals. Okay, we're doing front uh, raise, and then we do a front to the quarter raise, then we do side raise, bend over, underhand grip, you know, do a raise or whatever for the back delts, then we stay in that fixed position and do another lateral uh, variation. So it's gonna work all three delt heads, right? And I'm gonna make a tutorial on this exercise specifically to fucking burn and, and the fucking pump is insane right but anyway you know back to more important things drinking the night before you train holy shit can you do it yes is it gonna suck yes your boy you know what I'm saying pull like a 13 or 14 hour shift it'd been a long fucking week i'm doing manual labor again which is whatever in itself you know what i'm saying and I was like, fuck it, you know what? I need a drink. So I had a little bit more than expected. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you gotta live life, man. You only live once, you know what I'm saying? And, and, th and this picture right here, as you can see, I'm about ready to throw up in any minute. My head's pounding. I can't get a pump. My body's so dehydrated, but I'm like, you know what? I gotta fucking go to the gym. So I went anyway. So yeah, you can drink, you know what I'm saying? Be responsible, of course can live your life you know there's nothing wrong with having a few drinks you know I, I had a little bit more than a few drinks last night but um you know i'm paying for it today the reason why i got my hat so you know what i'm saying on my eyes and shit but uh yeah you know what I'm saying we never let's got it in so this is a super set right here um we did the um shoulder press with the underhand grip and went to low cable row or face pull i'm sorry and you know it's a good little combo right here you get a good pump in your shoulders you know what I'm saying? Again, back. I do so much emphasis on back delts because um, it's just like your upper chest for shoulders. You know, naturally, you don't have a lot of back delt. So I try to overcompensate, except for this genetic freak right here that you're looking at right here. This man that came out of his mom's womb and shit, looking like a damn action figure and shit. Now, I always have that genetic capability. Some of us had to actually work for our damn back delts. But anyway, so that's the reason why I overcompensate in doing so many back delt movements is because of that reason. Um, but yeah, I just want to talk to y'all about drinking. Drinking should not be a huge part of your diet. No, it should not. However, if you do decide to go out and drink again, be responsible. Get your ass in the gym the next day and do cardio. You know what I'm saying? Like, get a little bit of that out of your system. You know, suck it up. Get you a gallon jug. Kill half of that gallon jug before you even go to the damn gym. And then when you get to the gym, get some cardio in before you start your workout. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you can live your life, man. You don't got to be so strict, especially if you're not training for a show or nothing like that. But just, you know, remind yourself that, you know, sometimes, you you, you know, doing things like that will, have, you know, make you take a couple steps back. But it's okay because you have to keep your sanity. You have to live your life. You have to have fun. I get it, especially if you're young. But if you do it, just, you know what I'm saying, just know that in the gym next day, it might be a little difficult. Um, like I said, man, I was feeling the shit all day today. But um, this is a variation for your uh, your your back delts too. If you notice my hand positioning, you know what I'm saying. I kind of have like an outward grip, 
and that helps kind of isolate the back delts even more um, so I like doing it that way um, on the uh, reverse cable see I'm still kind of I can't even fucking talk right now on the reverse uh, pec deck fly, rear fly rear fly holy shit but uh, yeah, but anyway, I'm going to get off this commentary. I'm going to try to enjoy the rest of the video. Short video, I know, but I wanted to get y'all some content. Um, I don't want to go uh, another week without, you know, putting content up. But please like this video. Thumbs up. And please subscribe and put the little, you know, bell. Hit the little bell button for your notifications. That'll notify you every time I make a video. I am doing coaching. You know what I'm saying? I am doing online coaching. MCSFitness1987 at gmail.com. Hit me up.